Dan, it's your girl here, and in today's video, we're reacting to Darman. Rich kid refuses to tip the waitress. Let's do this. I should have bought that other purse, too. Oh, honey, you got a lot of nice things. <laughs> Which reminds me, I need my credit card back. Oh, of course. Here you go. Actually, I think I'm gonna hang on to it in case I need to buy some more stuff. <laughs> Okay. I hope that's my friend Dota. Hi, welcome in. Sorry for the wait. Um, here's your water. It's about time. Talk oh. about bad service. Beverly. This is why I don't work in in food or any other retail shop because I can't deal with the people who come in. I would slap them. I'd be, I'd be fired of an instant. I can't deal with people like this. No, get out. Get, go away. What? No, no, you're right. I am so sorry. I'm the only one working today, so we've just been a bit backed up. <laughs> It's perfectly fine, we understand. Uh, I'll take the Mandarin Crunch Salad. Excellent choice. She needs to be more like her daughter. And and for you? Just get me the same, but hurry it up. We don't have all day. These people go through so much stress and you've got these rich people who just don't have time for anything. Sit there and tell the waitress to hurry up. No, go home. If you want me to hurry up your food, go and buy something fast food. No, go home. She just told you that she's under a lot of stress. Jeez. Deal with these people. You got it. Here you go. Thank you. The mother knows. The mother's good. That wasn't nice. Who cares? She's just a waitress. I mean, how hard can that job be? <laughs> well, you wouldn't know, would you? You've never worked a day in your life. Whatever. Do you know people say that to me about YouTube? They're like, because I've, I've determined everything I've had on YouTube and I've, I have had jobs in the past, I've worked in the past and I, I can't really have a job now even though I've made YouTube my full-time job. People say to me, oh, you wouldn't know what work is like, you've never worked a day in your life. You guys should try pick up the camera and try and record and edit and render and upload every single day and come up with video ideas. You'd understand how much, how stressful it is. So my friends and I were thinking about going to Hawaii next month, is that okay? How much is that going to cost? I don't know. I was planning on using your credit card. Oh, All right, um, here is your salad. Thank you so much. Of course. Enjoy. She's so kind. Wait a second. Are there sunflower seeds in here? Uh, yes, they come with the salad you ordered. Are you trying to kill me? I'm allergic to sunflower seeds. Oh my gosh, I, I am so sorry. I had, I had no she idea. Didn't know. Um, uh, maybe you should have asked. I mean, you have a minimum wage paying job. How hard can that be? Beverly, stop. I don't swear, but she is a bitch. I'm sorry. I No, no, go home. Can't deal with these people. Cannot deal with these people. Up. It's not her fault. I should have never let you order the salad. I just spaced out. Her job is hard enough. Besides, you didn't eat any. You're fine. Don't make excuses yeah. for her, Mom. <laughs> Bring me another salad, and I expect you to remove this from the bill for the inconvenience. Absolutely. Right away. I'm so Holy sorry. Holy crap. She is so nasty. Wow. How could you treat her like that? You wouldn't want anybody to treat you like that, would you? Oh, please. She should know how to do her job. It's not rocket science. It takes two seconds to be, like, nice to someone. Two seconds. That was good. Here's your change. Thank you so much for coming in. And again, I truly, truly apologize for the mix-up. I, I probably... Don't even worry about it. It wasn't a problem. And all of this is for you. Wow, really? Thank you so much. I, I really appreciate it. Uh, what? No! <gasps> She took forever with our oh order and her then hand. tried to poison me. Beverly, give that back. Fine. You want a tipper? Then here. And you should be thankful. That's a lot more than you even deserve. Beverly! What? Oh my no. gosh, she deserves nothing. She deserves absolutely nothing. I'm sorry, bring your kids up with me. But I can't even say that because her mum is so nice. Her mum is so nice. Where did she get her this from? What an idiot. No, um, it's okay. It's totally fine. No, it's not okay. <sighs> it's not okay. She couldn't even do her simple job right. You know, being a waitress isn't easy. 
You never know how hard someone's job is until you do it yourself. Oh yeah? And how would you know? Yep. Because I used to be one. Before I started my business, how do you think we were paying the bills? By me waiting tables, that's how. Really? Ew. True shit. Well, it's a good thing you have money now, so I'll never have to worry about doing that. And oh, I that just I'd go make is the you. problem. I'd go make him it, do I am taking my credit card my back? Oh, yes, how am I supposed to pay mother. for things? You should. By getting a job. It's the only way you're going to learn the value of hard work. Uh, are, are you serious, Mom? No! You can't do this to me! I am serious. You put the money back and let's go. I like it. I like him, Mom. Her mum needs a reward for being such a good person. Her daughter, though, on the other hand, she needs a slap. I'm sorry, but like, quick bat slap, you'd be fine. She just cries. She won't die. Don't worry. Beverly can't believe what just happened and follows her mom out. I like her coat, though. Now that <gasps> Beverly can't use her mom's credit card anymore, she has no choice but to look for a job. Ha! Comma. She ends up getting hired as a waitress at a new restaurant that just opened up. Everything seems to be going fine. That is, until she has to take on multiple tables at once and gets yelled at by angry customers for taking too long with their orders. Karma, I love karma. Karma's my best friend, I love it. No matter how hard she works, customers just expect more and more out of her and she can't seem to do anything right. Yes. Beverly starts to get really stressed out. After working so hard and taking care of all of her customers, she hardly has <laughs> even anything to show for it. Yes, your pennies. She now understands how hard being a waitress really is. And then a few months later, she happens to run into her old waitress. So my friends and I decided not to go to Hawaii. It's so expensive. Run out of money. <laughs> well, it's a lot different when you have to pay for things yourself, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, welcome to... Oh, um... I know you didn't like my service last time. Want me to get someone else? No, please. I'm actually really sorry for how I treated yeah. you before. You are? Yeah. Nasty oh. person. Thank you. Would you like the same salads as last time? Yeah, that would be amazing. <laughs> oh, but please don't forget that. I know. No sunflower seeds. <laughs> Yes, thank Any you for remembering. I'll be sure to leave you an extra big tip this time. <laughs> wow, honey. I am so proud of it's you. It's called life. It's called getting up and sucking up you know and what? getting on with life. I'm gonna let you have my credit Ooh, card Oh, don't now. do that. That's the most stupid really? mistake ever. Oh my gosh. Actually, it's okay, Mom. It actually feels really good working for everything that I have. Thank you, though. <sighs> so you see, you never really know how hard someone's job is until you have to do it yourself. And that's true, because the next time you go into a shop, or you go in to get a food, or you watch a YouTube video, for example, understand how hard they work to get this to you, the service that they provide to you the way that you want it. Guys, everyone messes up in life, everyone messes up in their job. Sometimes their job isn't the best of days, but we all work our hardest, and our absolute hardest to provide this service, and to put food on the table for ourselves, put food on the table for our family, keep a roof over our head. We don't do it for fun, like who wants to work? No one wants to work. No no one wants to go to work for fun. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do want me to react to more Garman, let me know in the comment section below. I'll see you all in the next one. It's been your girl. I'm out of here. Peace. Bye, guys.